Well, this doesn't need much of an explanation, does it? Today is either going to go spectacularly or spectacularly wrong. <laughs> this is my aerial nomad and it's at the playground. The playground which for the first month has been purely mountain bike trails themed. But it's a playground for many reasons. Reasons that haven't been realised and discovered yet. Reasons that I've only just brought to the playground today. Because this thing's back from a service where it's had some upgrades, some mods at Aerial. And it really is just the most, it's the coolest machine ever. And my bike's on it. I actually drove it here with a working functional bike rack. With my front wheel attached to the spare wheel. I'll talk about the mods in a minute, but welcome to episode nine at the playground. So episode eight was massive, wasn't it? It was almighty. We built so much. We had two build lapses. Effectively, everything you can see in this entire area was built in episode eight, some in seven. So much work. This is the birdie burn, which we test rode and it's sick. You can proper corkscrew up it like a helix. It's awesome. Yeah. It's like riding a strand of DNA. <laughs> yesterday I went to Wales. So it's been the first day away from the playground. And weirdly in that one day, we've got our very first rabbit problem, <laughs> which sucks. They don't half make a mess, do they? It's, it's a shame. They want to burrow in every single feature. But in fairness to them, I'd be upset if someone built a motorway in my, next to my house. I don't know where <laughs> they live, but they're trying to make that their house. That their house, the big nine iron land in their house, soon they will move in. So I think we can't have another day off because they seem to capitalize upon our absence <laughs> and actually work really hard. We could employ them. <laughs> so we've got a rabbit problem. We'll deal with that. Uh, ben is going to ride today. This video, obviously, I've not just brought the Nomad here. I'm going to jump the Nomad. I want to drive it around everywhere. This place is perfect for off-roading. So it's like the dream setup now. But Ben hasn't ridden this, have you? No. Nope. So that's going to happen. We've got our bikes. We're going to ride all of it. And it's the first day in a little while, especially since building this area, that we've got fantastic sunshine. So the jumps look the best they've ever looked. And look at the difference in the drone shots now. Like the whole place is so pronounced, so amplified and just so perfect. I'm pumped we've built jumps on grass. We've actually turned a lawn into a freestyle facility and it shows now for the first time ever. A little reminder, episode 10, the next one's gonna be the double XL, huge long one. So today we are gonna let our hair down and just kind of enjoy the place, enjoy our fruits of our labor. We're a bit rested. I'm gonna build a pond in episode 10 here, so I won't be rested. I'll be pickaxing to my heart's content. <laughs> but we're gonna just drive that thing around. So a lot of people know about this car, but if you don't, they're very rare. Ariel make a very limited number of this awesome car. Ariel are famous for the Atom. This is like they're lifted off-road but still really track ready weapon it's my weapon of choice i've got a winch on it owning suspension huge light bar a snorkel a spare wheel so much cool stuff and it's really 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 good off-road it's rear wheel drive it's supercharged it has 300 horsepower it weighs 700 and a bit kilos without my bike and some bits and it's sick and i want to jump it really high in the air and i think i'm going to do it out of here don't you think that'll work? It's just less than a car length, so I might go over the bars. <laughs> don't need that. So should we start with that or do you want to ride bikes? I think we should do the car. The yeah. engine's warm. I just got yeah. here. Yeah? So let's yeah. go for an off-road rally, make a little track, have a laugh, and then we'll try and get the thing up in the air. And Ben can lie down and I'll jump him. No yeah, thanks. Do that. <laughs> I'm not going to drive around with the bike on. Feels unnecessary, doesn't it? Look how, qu look how quick release this bike rack is, though. Ariel fitted this for me. Look. Posh. How good's that? Not bad. That's how quick you go from bike transport to rally mode. The other upgrades I got is this LED light whip. So there's an orange light that goes all the way up there. At night, it looks insane. Apparently orange is the only color that's actually legal. So I went with that one, like a good boy. And I got a brake bias knob fitted, which has got loads of adjustments. What that does, it means you can like adjust the braking. So when you push the brake, it all goes to the front, all goes to the rear or anywhere in between. The car comes 50-50. Apparently if you wind it all to the rear on a track day and just left foot brake in a corner, it like drift, the ultimate drift car, if it wasn't already. <laughs> What's on your head? Looks like you're going diving, mate. Does it? Yeah. It's my snorkel mask. Nice. This is playground squared now, isn't it? <laughs> and in a minute, I know you hate it, you're going to be a passenger. Oh. I'm going to put the camera in here facing you. Just you. Because you hate it, don't you? I absolutely hate it, yeah. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! No! No! Is that gonna happen? I don't know! <laughs> 
gonna have to do it, mate. Uh, <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> oh, that is the funniest looking thing ever. Yeah, but what are you going to winch it to? Brambles! I'll we'll put a shovel in the ground. I mean, try and reverse. See if you can reverse. I always want to use the winch. This is why I expect it. Just try first. <laughs> ah! 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 Oh, you oh, can... Oh, yeah. Can I just launch? <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, mate. That is insane. No problem. You actually just crashed. How often do you have an actual car crash and then go and build a job? That was a car crash. Can I watch that back? Yeah. I actually, this thing's the best. <laughs> crash it. <laughs> I was just going to give you a demo of what I mean because you don't think it'll work, do you? Uh, I'm sceptical. How funny was that? <laughs> so I'm happy there wasn't a tree stump or anything. <laughs> so we'd have done this, clip that onto itself. Looks like you know what you're doing, mate. This is just me checking that crashing is an option. Because <laughs> there's lots of holes like that and they do come up on your quick bed. <laughs> I did, I like did a little drift there and caught the wheel upside down. It's like 101 <laughs> of drifting, isn't it? Don't catch the wheel upside down. <laughs> So I thought I was going to go straight and it just shot me into whatever that hole is. Oh no! Shovel's coming out! <laughs> Need a bigger anchor. At least it works. It doesn't. It's pull, I've made, all I've proved is I can pull the car downhill. That is true, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought he was going to twist it. <laughs> Purpose. <laughs> <laughs> if that was a dirt, if that had dirt on it, you'd eventually move a jump from sat in a car. <sighs> right, Glenn's jumping in. We're going to go for a quick passenger lap. I've just, got my helmet on. Just because he hates it, I'll do one crash. Use the winch. Now I think let's do a lap and then go straight into this kicker and see what happens. I'm pretty fearful we're going to get bucked. Oh, so get your harness done up tight. <sighs> On the playground really is what it is, Ben. Yeah. Two favourite things in one week: wheelbarrows. Yeah. And being a passenger That's, in this. Yeah. Oh. Straight up there. Well, there's a huge hole. Oh my god! I've stalled. I've stalled on a hill. Yeah, I think so. 
you're, you're skiing. You're, you're, you're grinding. <laughs> Oh, he's got a big run up for this one. <laughs> oh. oh my god! <laughs> that is so sick. We need a more mellow jump. That is so sick. Do you kind of know what I mean? Your entrance into that was just the cooler than the jump itself. What, we're just rickety? It's like sideways jumping. Yeah. yeah. That was rad. I think this is half the problem, or actually the entirety of the problem is that my ramp I've chosen isn't long enough. It's not even the full length of the car. So when the front wheels leave the ground, the back ones and the back suspension is still getting loaded up in that bottom compression. So then it just wants to dive. It's actually bucking the whole car. And it makes more sense talking about that on a bike. I never thought I'd be talking about my car getting bucked, <laughs> but here we are. And I did promise no building in this video. So in episode 10, I've got the best idea. All of these turf blocks lying around that look like we've got loads of kind of small temples for termites. <laughs> I think we should bring them all together here and build a massive long ski jump that starts all the way oh back my here, God. finishes even higher, like up here, so we could build like a brick and block massive ski jump. They're circling. God, we get all the viewers, don't we? Online and airborne. <laughs> Why don't we make a ski jump out of turf blocks? Because they're useless for riding bikes on, but we never describe them as useless for driving cars on. I think they'll be perfect. I think this helicopter's gonna land, Matt. <laughs> He's flashing. Oh my God. It's someone we know. It's my mate, Alex. <laughs> no way, so he's just landing in a field. What a lunatic. <laughs> this is really weird. <laughs> That was the weirdest thing that's ever happened to me in my life, I think. Oh my god. That's actually surreal. I told him like roughly where it is, just the town name, and I said I reckon you could land there and there he comes. <laughs> just as I was talking about my nomad. That was insane. The playground's gone from bikes to cars, bizarrely, to helicopters. <laughs> He landed here on the slice. <laughs> I feel like we need oh. to do a helipad feature. <laughs> yeah. It needs a helipad. Oh my god. I've got the shakes. That was that so was weird. That was insane. I don't even have the shakes yet. I think I'm about to pass out. Because I was like soon. kind of subtly like, oh that's helicopters loud. This is making filming annoying. <laughs> yeah, for you. <laughs> then it's like swung a 180. I thought it won't be Alex because he doesn't know where it is. How cool does it look from the air? That yeah, the video's taken a really bizarre bench. Really we go, weird. We, should we ride our bikes? Yeah, I'm before I like to have to go to bed. Ride. I'm, yeah, I'm <laughs> feel like you need to go to bed. heavy ride. <laughs> <laughs> We're so lucky. <laughs> Just do biking. Thank you, Alex. He's oh the man. God. He's actually the man. That was so That's sick. That's the coolest thing. I want one so badly. Never been on in my life. I know, it's the and best weirdest then. feeling. It's get really like, geez, negative, positive, negative, positive, don't you? So strange. I don't know how episode 10 is going to trump that. We'll have to jump that car really high <laughs> and get some pro riders down and build loads of stuff, I promise. <laughs> that spurred me on. This place is sick. Let's ride bikes. <laughs>
I can't trust after how today's gone that a herd of pink elephants won't just roll through here now, or even dinosaurs. <laughs> it's all running quite fast, Ben, other than the rabbit holes, which I'm are nervous. everywhere. Oh, no, it failed. <laughs> nice. When you come back, those rollers before the step down feel so slow. Okay. Like you'll go to yourself, I'm never, I'm not even going to make it up the step okay. down, but you do because it pulls away. All right, okay. It might be a new sensation. Let's see if I can even get to that, to be honest. <laughs> oh. You all right? Yeah. Oh my god, that was so sketchy! Sick. Oh, that That's was our cool. first ever train. Whoa, it is. Yeah. Oh, that was really sketchy. Where on the step down? Just everything, mate. I went really long on the wedge. Really? Yeah, you flipped. It scared me. Did you feel how um, the dust has been swept off of those? Yeah. Jumps. That's a nice little gift there. Yeah. Probably a machine that costs five hundred grand. Yeah, it saves a lot of manual yeah. labour though. Save money on the old leaf blower. <laughs> Yeah, let's do that again. I'd like to follow you. Okay. Don't worry if you have to pull out. Yeah. I'll, I'll keep an eye on you. Too close. I'm a bit unreliable. Okay. <laughs> unreliable. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Oh, it feels so sick, doesn't it? We feel an unbelievable oh line. Yes. I don't know what my favorite bit is because there's so much variety everywhere. There's berms, hips, hips both ways, step down, step ups. Trains feel good. Trains feel way more exciting. Go on, Ben. That was nice. Oh. Yes, lad. Pulling, pulling up. Yeah, dude! Full lap, that's your first solo lap! You look great on those two, really, really good. Mate, it feels so good. That's sick. Right, I want to backflip the nine iron. Are you? Yeah, I'm well up for it. That was sick, mate. How good does it feel? Good, I was really nose heavy there, did you see? Yeah, you were. I'm sad Jamie's not here. I think he'd be able to get way further today. I'm going to do it, mate. I'm going to backflip the nine iron. Yeah. And then 360 bar spin this. And I might even try and tuck no hand to the hip. Okay. The slice. Here you go, mate. I'm nervous. It's a big the land. It's a big landing on the nine iron to enter out upside down. Come in. Okay, here we go. Yes. 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 Oh, oh no! <laughs> Don't worry about that. <laughs> yes. So sick. I'll take that. Mate, I'll give you that. I'll take that. The bar spin really hurt my shoulder. Did it? It's an awkward, um, an awkward movement. And then I was kind of worried over that roller whether I could do no hander. Thank you. Fair play. That felt amazing. Super smooth. As you leave the lip, it's like above you, the landing's below you, you can't see it, and you just go, sky. <laughs> oh. It's a sick feeling. <laughs> oh man, what a day, hey? I don't know what to say. We could probably keep riding, but I think I want to end the video there, and I want to start figuring some stuff out for the next video. I hope you've liked episode nine. <laughs> we have. <laughs> it's been the best day ever. <laughs> but it hasn't had any build lapses, and I know a lot of you are here for the progress, but we had to kind of sit back and enjoy it. I wanted to see Ben get through the line. I wanted to ride it more and do some tricks, but like I say, next week we've got some pro riders coming. So I want to figure out like a flare on that hip, maybe a 540 on it. I'll put some pads on and do some proper backflip tricks over this. The nine iron has more potential that you know. There's a lot yeah. of things to work out, but definitely for that big mega video. But you're probably thinking, what are we going to build? Because we finished this line. So we're going to have a good long read through the comments for your ideas. But perhaps before starting the next like mega line, which is going to take forever, we could probably spend an episode or two building Jamie's sideline. We had a few people commenting about that when he flew off the side of the course. Yeah, yeah boy. He's found the cool line. That is a brilliant line. That he'd actually like discovered a line and pioneered it. So why don't we build that? Because although we have this split line, what we don't have is the ability to like last minute change line, get back in. Mm. 
So rather than go and build a line over there, I think it would be sad to not kind of add to this one a bit in a tidy, cool, clean way, especially if Jamie is nervous about this big one, he could maybe go round it, you know? Yeah. But there's some good build lapses. We'll get on with that in episode 10. <laughs> Still can't believe the heli. That it's was a weird so old weird. thing. Funny old thing. Oh, and I've got to jump that thing massive. Legends.